it looks like Nicki Minaj might want to host the Real Housewives of Potomac reunion. And it looks like they might need it because their ratings are steadily declining since the premiere. Welcome back to the Kempire Daily YouTube channel where you get daily and consistent hot topics in music, entertainment, reality TV, and so much more. As always, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on breaking news when we go live or when we upload. So as you know, the Real Housewives of Potomac, we've been reviewing and recapping and following all of the side stories. Well, now Nicki Minaj is throwing her hat in the ring via social media, and she would like to host the reunion of the Real Housewives of Potomac reunion. But before we get into that, I've said multiple times here on the channel is that, look, Andy Cohen is great at what he does. But especially for the Real Housewives of Atlanta and the Potomac reunions, I always felt they should have gotten someone else specifically a black woman. There's so much incredible talent here on YouTube, here on social media of really up and comings. You know, you always are talking of Bravo, talking about inclusivity, diversity. Let's start there. Let's start with the actual platforms that are diverse. And I get it. Andy is the one of the executive producers of this franchise. But based on what we're hearing, because of the ratings falling in all of the, the franchises, including The Real Housewives of New York, we're hearing that Andy and some of the executives at these production companies are no longer involved in the decision making for the, the housewives. That's a rumor. Not sure if it's true or not. But it would make some sense, especially when there's been a steady decline in ratings across the franchise. We'll get to the Potomac ratings in a second. But Nicki Minaj, and if you don't know, she follows me on TikTok, and I now understand why. She loves The Real Housewives of Potomac, and I recap them and talk about them on my TikTok. So if you're not following me, you should. Nicki Minaj does. I'm one of 16 people. Blink. <laughs> Anyways. So Nicki Minaj posted on her Instagram uh, the video where they sampled her song, you know, that was part of the promo for Potomac. And she captioned the photo this. I'll be hosting the reunion. Let me know what y'all want me to ask, child. Mind you, this has not been confirmed because Watch What Happens Live and Bravo were in her comments like, oh my God. First of all, Bravo's having a moment this week because Rihanna weighed in on The Real Housewives of New York because she's watching. And if Rihanna's watching, everyone else should be watching. Okay? We talked about that during our recap this week. But now Nicki Minaj, another icon in music, is weighing in and saying that she would like to host. But I wonder if Andy Cohen, even though he might be a fan of Nicki Minaj, is willing to let go of his ego and allow an actual Black woman to host this show? We shall see. And we're also not sure how serious Nicki Minaj might be about hosting it. I, either way, Nicki Minaj is always entertaining. I can I can literally watch a Nicki Minaj interview multiple times. I can't tell you the amount of times I've watched Nicki Minaj on The Breakfast Club. She's just naturally funny. But anyways, in the comments of this particular post, someone asked her if she should be on the remix of Candace's new song, Drive Back. She didn't know the song. And then, so, then someone pointed out to her, you know, the song is by Candace. And she's like, oh, yeah, that's a nice song. But she has other things that she wants to talk about Candace about. Look, the season already started. So what could Nicki Minaj be referring to? I'm sure it's the fight between M Monique and Candace. Either way, it would be interesting to see Nicki Minaj host the Real Housewives of Potomac reunion. Let me know what your thoughts would be on that in the comments. But since we're talking about the Real Housewives of Potomac reunion, you sh it should be noted that the ratings, you know, they started out for the bank. They had over a million viewers for their premiere episode. But there's been a steady decline from the second episode and now this third episode. The third episode of, of the season six of the Real Housewives of Potomac only came in at 885,000 viewers in their 18 to 49 demographic. Well, that's not good for just this just being the third season. It's been a steady decline since the very first episode. And it came out with a bang. Not sure what that means. Not sure why people aren't watching. Not sure what's turning people off to this particular franchise. Based on what I've heard, everyone feels like Potomac is the city right now in this franchise. But I've also been hearing that people are a little bit over the Real Housewives and that they feel like there needs to be major shakeups across the different cities. 
But it seems as if people were happy with Potomac. But here's the thing. Last season really was a dark season for her for that particular city. And a lot of people were saying when Monique did not come back that they would be tuning out. And apparently it looks like it might be true. Let's continue the conversation in the description area. I wanna know your thoughts on why you think the Real Housewives of Potomac ratings are dropping every single week. Also how you feel about Nicki Minaj possibly hosting the reunion or someone else you would like to host the reunion. Look, we've talked about it multiple times here. I'm ready to see it. I'm ready to see a change. And it might begin with getting rid of Andy. Andy is going to be fine, y'all. He already has Watch What Happens Live, and he has the check that he gets from all of these different cities. He'll be fine. <laughs> Let's continue the conversation in the comment section. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on breaking news when we go live or when we upload. Thanks for watching.